Meanwhile, a state lawmaker tonight is taking steps to try and better protect the men and women in blue. State Senator Jim Merritt says he's going to draft a measure to toughen the penalties on people who harm off-duty public safety officers and their families as well. Our TV6 State House reporter Katie Hines joins us live to explain. Katie. Well, Jason, Senator Merritt says that those penalties are tougher under state law if a law enforcement officer or a public safety officer is harmed while on the job, but it's different if they are off duty, off the clock. The dangers are growing. Merritt points to an Indianapolis man facing charges for firing 17 bullets into an IMPD officer's house and squad car. That happening last month. An IMPD assistant chief confirms a growing number of his officers are parking their squad cars in the garage and out of public view while off duty. He says that's a change from when some would pour an extra slab of concrete to make room in their driveway. We talked to the wife of an IMPD officer who's been on the job for more than a decade. She understands firsthand. For so many years, we just, it was a point of pride. Um, and people looked at that police car in the driveway as a safety point. Um, obviously, recently, that's not so much the case anymore. And we have much more from her and her perspective coming up tonight at 6. But for right now, no proposal has been drafted, nothing in writing yet. We're told from Senator Merritt that it will apply, though, to all public safety officers. So that includes police, sheriff's deputies, firefighters, and EMTs, something he hopes to get in writing before the next legislative session. For now, we're live. Katie Hines, RTV6.